Hello and welcome to Storytime. I'm Mr. Reed. Now, today's story is being delivered as we speak by Cara. Say hello, Cara. Hello, Cara. Thank you very much. And this story comes all the way from Trinidad and Tobago from a lady called Nisa Bali. And you'll find the story here as I read and all the links below. It's called The Monster Who Came to Visit. I asked a monster to my home. My master plan, you see. Because I thought if we were friends, then he'd stop <gasps> scaring me. He ate a hundred pancakes and drank two jugs of juice. <sighs> Asking him to use a glass <sniffs> was really of no use. He busted up all my crayons and used up all my paint. His drawings on the walls would make my mother <gasps> faint. He tried to give my cat a bath. He chased her for an hour. And when he finally gave up, he gave my dog a shower. I tried to read him storybooks to help him go to sleep. Instead, he took my pillow and loudly counted sheep. About to leave the bedroom, he insisted that I stay. So I held his hand until he snored and... <laughs> drifted right away. As I sat and watched the monster, it was very plain to see. The more and more I thought of it, hmm, he was really just like me. <laughs> That's a lovely story and beautifully illustrated. Now, I love that story, but I would also love more stories. So if you've written a story, the address, as always, is... This week, the story time at you now. That's it. There it is. So get writing, get sending, and until the next time, bye-bye.